So Safi, how are you doing? Uh oh, I called her Safi. She's gonna go mad on me now. <laughs> she's leaving the camera, guys. She doesn't like being called Safi. Uh oh, she's left. I'm finally going to my doctor's appointment. I've been holding it off for about six days. I've got serious pain. You and Safira are arguing every day? Mm, cut mm. that. I'm cut putting that. you out there, aren't I? No. You Have you had a good week? No. Why? The no, the question is. Go on. How What's up, guys? It's the Monago family. Hey. Well, I'm on my own today, so it's Monago family. Mum, what is up? How are we all doing? Welcome back to our channel. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe. Why would you not want to join a family like this? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm on my own anyway. <laughs> Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know when we post and share around so everybody knows who we are. I'm joking. Me and Nietzsche headed out last night for the first time in about five or six days to go to the supermarket and that was fine. I'm finally going to my doctor's appointment. I've been holding it off for about six days. I've got serious back pain. I'm chancing it now to the hospital. I've checked the routes, checked with some people and they said it's okay. So let's see if I get there. So I'll see you on the other side. I made it! Do you know what? It is the small things in life <laughs> that you get happy about sometimes when it's a crisis situation. But to be honest, it was all right. So I made a bit of a mistake. I was talking to, you know, my lovely husband, Uche, on the phone. He was keeping me company on the way. And I missed my turn at such a crucial point because I was literally 12 minutes away. Now, if you miss a turn in Dubai, really unforgiving, I must say. If you miss a turning during a time where there's floods and most roads are close, then you are absolutely stuffed. So I missed the turn and then it added about 25 minutes to my journey not to talk of the traffic so it was all right there was like one little puzzle that I had to go into but that was it it wasn't too bad based on what you know has just happened Dubai has done amazing to clear up all the roads I'm watching like all the Dubai has come together like everybody's working really really hard um, to get everything sorted so it was safe for me to drive here I got here and I'm really really happy a lot of people are asking about whether you know it's safe to fly to Dubai everything look guys we are just sharing our journey in Dubai I literally don't have a news report of every area in Dubai like to be honest with you I probably will find out about everything like yourself by going online um, obviously yes we are living in Dubai and we speak to more people but generally if I'm honest with you where we live we thank God we're safe we're fine what I can suggest to people who are trying to fly here a lot of people have messaged us who have booked flights just to come here for holidays again you're gonna have to call up your hotels find out from your travel you know whoever you booked with and they'll be able to tell you the situation where you're going to stay but in most cases, most hotels, large high rise buildings and hotel, generally they do get through these storms. But again, I can't tell you that. So wherever you booked, wherever you, you're going to have to contact them, find out what's going on there. Listen, I drove two and a half hours today and I got here safely. It, that's, and I drove from one part of Dubai to another part. So I'm now in Dubai Hills, which is like near Jumeirah, near these areas, and everything looks absolutely fine to me. Yes, you can see a bit of damage as expected, but everything looks, you know, normal to me and starting to feel a bit more normal so yeah just check in but yeah don't let it deter you from coming here though or coming like natural disasters happen in every country I know it's going around everywhere but natural disasters happen in every single country every country has its problems Dubai is not perfect I know people think oh yeah because it's got all this money blah 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 no just don't let it deter you if you're trying to move here don't let people rob you from your dreams don't let people say to you because what will happen is people start yapping in your ear whacking around and you get these you know the white noise that I call it which is you know you shouldn't move there because this happened blah 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 yeah you just need to make sure you stick to what you want to do obviously check you know safety but just stick to what you want to do and if you want to come here on holiday also book your holiday and come here on holiday just check you know that you have booked it for the right time check your hotel check everything and you'll be fine i've gone on too much now i need to go for my appointment i'm dying for a wee <laughs> I've been in this car for ages, so sorry, too much information. But yeah, we're all good on this end. And yeah, we'll catch up with the family a bit later when I get home and I'll let you know how my appointment goes. All right, hey guys, so I'm done. Had my doctor's appointment, had an x-ray. I've just got some issues with my neck and stuff. So I have to have some physiotherapy. So nothing too bad, but I'm always so amazed by how quickly I can get an appointment and an x-ray. But yeah, I wanted to try and see if I can get you, cause I know a lot of people want to see how Dubai is obviously looking, but you know, from where I'm standing, obviously, like I said, people have to go do their checks, etc. But, you know, let me see if I can get a little bit of out here. So look, you can see out here. Car park so this is the hospital here as you can see so yeah this obviously you know the floods were on Tuesday and this is where we are so yeah I drove here 
and that was absolutely fine. I'm gonna try and head home now. Hopefully it won't take me too long. And then yeah, we can catch up with the family. Hey, what's up guys? What's up guys? So to everybody who hasn't met you before, should we tell them your names? Yeah, I'm Kyra. You're Kyra. And who are you on the left? Who's that there? And that's Kyla. So guys, how are you doing today? Good. What's up family? So girls, you wore different clothes today. Yeah. Guys, this is the first time Kyra and Kyla, right, have ever worn, got dressed and worn different clothes today. Look, they've got different dresses on today. When they came down, I said to mum, I can't believe they're wearing different clothes. Yeah, it was when we were upstairs today. Yeah. And then she was wearing dresses. Nice. They were like, they want to wear different things. And I was like, no, you can't because you have to wear the same things because you always wear the same thing. And they're like, no, we want to wear, we want to wear different ones today. I was like, wow, this is really good preparation for when they start their new school. Because <laughs> they're going to separate classes, aren't they? They're finding their own identity, which I really like. Yeah, so Kyra and Kyla, why did you wear different dresses? Because Kyra wanted to wear the pink dress and I wanted to wear a different dress. Really? Yeah. So you didn't want to dress the same today? Yeah. Mm, so this is our first time ever doing it, right? Yeah. Yeah, well you both look nice. Yeah. Yeah? You ready to go get some food with us? Yeah. With the family? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Alright. No, just food bit, not play bit. You've done enough playing today. You played for the whole day today. No, we played play on work. one day. No, you played for summer today. You did some work. It's still dark out. But we did work in the play area. You did work in the play area as yeah, well. Yeah, that we played. We play. But you did work at home as well. But we did a lot of zombies and then in the morning I showed you and you were like, wow. I was like, wow, yeah. <laughs> Myra, have you had a good week this week? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. What, tell me some highlights of your week. What have you had? Today that we're going to eat Chinese. <laughs> That's just part of I the week food. though. What about the rest of the week? Staying um, home, spending time with the family? Yeah. It's been nice? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. You and Sephira are arguing every day? Mm, mm. Cut that. I'm cut putting that. you out there, aren't I? No. I'm putting you out there, aren't I? You argue sometimes with your best friends as well. So where is that best friend anyway? Where is she? Guys, so She's crawling under the table <laughs> to get out of the table. What are you doing, Sephira? Crawling under <laughs> the table to get into the camera. Why didn't you just come round like a normal person? Because it should be. Yeah. He's dark underneath here as well, and Kyra and Kyla are going to join you. So come out from under the table, Sephira. Come on, come on. My best friend's here now. Your best friend. Ah, oh, that's cute. Oh. And cute. by the way, guys, this was also. What's a up? This was also. Hold this on, was Sephira. Also... Hold on, Sephira. This was also. It's me! Sephira. And this... <laughs> Myra was saying something. Go this on. was also a part of my vesting because today I dressed Sephira today and I did her edges and her hair. <laughs> and her top, and I chose her um, outfit for her today as well. That was, so that this is not the clothes that she chose, but earlier uh, we had, we were going to a party, and yeah, she styled me. She styled you? Yeah, and I oh, let nice. her use my clock clip. Oh, yeah. nice. That's good, sister, you love you. That's nice. Ah, so sweet. So, Safi, how you doing? Uh-oh, I called her Safi. She's going to go mad on me now. <laughs> she's leaving the camera, guys. She doesn't like being called Safi. Uh-oh, she's left. She's out of here. <laughs> okay, come on, Sephira, come back. Come on, quick. <laughs> How are you doing? Have you had a good week? No. Why? The qu no, the question is... Go on. How is Uche doing? Oh! Uche, who's Uche? Who's Uche? <laughs> who's Uche? How's dad doing? Don't be silly. Uche, <laughs> mind yourself, girl. What's wrong with this girl, Shelby? Shelby, what's wrong with her? I don't know what's wrong with her. Friday what is night, wrong with her? Friday night fever. Comment down below who you actually think is the craziest in the family. I have I have a good idea. Who's the craziest? One the family? Oh, no, 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 Potentially two children, actually. There's another one, actually. That's it's mommy. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, no. it's, it's daddy. I have. Myra. Guys, it's guys. No, guys. I, I would just like to say I have absolutely no idea what they're talking about. Um, <laughs> No, let's see. So comment down below, guys. Let us know who you think the craziest in the Monago family is. Okay, it's comment Daddy. down below. It's we want to know. Daddy, Sophia, and Kyla. It's who? Daddy, Sophia, and Kyla. That's what Mommy was saying. <laughs> it's not me. Daddy, yeah. Sophia, and Kyla. I didn't say that. We hope you guys are all good, by the way. Comment down below. Um, a lot of you guys have been asking if we're I didn't okay. Say my what's up. You left me out. Okay, come you on, really Sophia. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Say what's up. Go on. Disappointed. You're disappointed. Go on then. Family Sephira! Family Sephira! Family Sephira! Hey! He 
just remixed our song. Yeah, Hold on. Three people out there. Look, yeah, all three of the crazy people. Sophia, <laughs> run. So guys, um, a lot of you have been asking if we're okay. We are all good, man. It's been a tough week. We just had to stay in a bit this week. But otherwise, you know, our villa's great. Luckily, we thank God everything's fine with us. We're all good. So thank you for checking in on us. We're going to go grab some food now um, because I'm starving. It's quite late here and I'm sure the kids are starving too. And um, we're going to a restaurant. If we can catch some of the restaurant, we'll put it in there as well for you guys. Um, if they let us film. Uh, we found a cool Chinese restaurant last week. All right, should we get out of here, guys? Yeah! Hey guys, so this is the community, as you can see. Like I said earlier, like Richie said earlier, everything is pretty much intact. I mean, there's not nothing that's really <laughs> out of place for us, really. For us, yeah. And we're yeah, thankful yeah, so. for, that, for that, you know. Yeah, so we live in a really well-built area to anyone who's affected by anything. Prayers to them and we hope all, everyone else's families are okay. But we're just trying to show you that, look, we're good. We're off to get some food now because we haven't been out as a family for a while. Um, and that's that. So guys, we're in a place called International City. And so in this place, there's like different countries. So we're in the China part of International City and we're about to get some Chinese. Mara, why are you pulling my hand up? Because they can't see me. Okay, so say what's up. What's up? Okay, so we're in International City. If you pull my hand down, up, so we're going to go get some up. food. Discovered a nice Chinese restaurant. Is this way, guys? And we're going to go get some food now. Basically, my test for whether you're eating good Chinese food is when you see Chinese people eating in the restaurants that you're eating in, then you know that it's the real deal. So if you ever want to know if you find a good Chinese restaurant, see if Chinese people actually come to eat in the restaurant, then you know it's a good restaurant. Let's check this place out. I'm not going to bother say the name, but yeah, this is where we're at. Um, check this place out. I didn't bother say the name, Charmaine. Come say the name. Come say what it's called. It's up here, it's up here. Look, look, it's up here. Go on then. Louis Guo I wanted to say it. Catering LLC. Okay, well, we can't say the name, but we're here. Guys, they've got like an open kitchen. It's pretty cool. Open kitchen area. The full restaurant. Is this where we're sitting? Mmm, so good. So guys, we are back home. As you can see, all of us are back home. Can I get closer to you guys? Can you see all of us? I hope you can. Thank you for chilling with us. We love you guys. We appreciate you guys, as you know. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to join the family. Why wouldn't you want to join a family like this? Does anyone do the pose? Does anyone get it? I think we got it. MF Squad, hit that like button because you know the likes keep our channel alive and hit the notification bell so you know when we post. That's it. Like you just don't care. Put your hands in the air and peace out.